course, Joy Joy Official. Um, if you're new here, my name is Ariane Joy. And well, I do daily vlogs. Well, not daily, of course, but I do vlogs. And today, I'm gonna show you a new French lesson. Uh, so yeah, I, I posted a poll and a lot of people wanted to know um, in French, of course names of animals so that's what i'm gonna do today today we are gonna learn animals names in french so let's get to it so first we're gonna name we're gonna learn the french words for pets like the animals you keep at home so first the pets the first one's gonna we're gonna name dogs a, what's a dog in French? A dog in French. It's a chien. Un chien. It's right there. Un chien. That's a dog in French. C'est un chien. That's the first one. The next we're gonna learn is cat. You know, cats are so cute. Also dogs. Like my friend not saying her name she has like three 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 cats then my other best friend she's like three cats also and then like my first grade teacher she also has like two three cats oh my gosh there's so much cats they're adorable so yeah cat in french is a chat a chat a chat cat in french is a chat and then <laughs> that the pet I have, or uh, a hamster, in French is our hamster, our hamster, our hamster. So yeah, I have a hamster, <laughs> and just for the fun of it, I'm gonna put a picture of my adorable hamster right there. Ta da! Ah, oh, delicious. No, I'm just kidding. Of course, she's a. It's, uh, yeah, she is adorable. Yeah. So, her hamster. My hamster is adorable. My hamster is adorable. The next uh, pet house animal is a guinea pig. Her cochon dand. Her cochon dand. That's a guinea pig. Anyways, I'll still put one right here. That's a guinea pig. It's so cute. Anyways, a guinea pig is a cochon dand. And now, a rabbit. A rabbit is a lapin. Or in a feminine, femina, it's a lapin. But, but, you can just say lapa. A rabbit is a lapa. I'm back. Um, so yeah, we're on to birds. Um, a bird in French is a oiseau. A oiseau. Yeah. Okay. Oiseau. Bird in French is a oiseau. Oiseau. <gasps> I got you right on the Okay. Anyways, a bird in French is oiseau. Now, let's talk about different kinds of birds. For example, a cardinal, uh, a pigeon. A pigeon, a parrot, a duck. It's a bird, right? Yeah, okay. Anyways, first we're gonna learn a parrot. Like, you know, those things in cartoons where, where all the pirates have a parrot in their shoulder. Yeah, a parrot in French is un perroquet. Un perroquet. That's a parrot in French. Un perroquet. They're so colorful though. 
Okay, now a pigeon. A pigeon in French is a pigeon. Pigeon. A pigeon is a pigeon. 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 Y'all have to say else, okay? Okay, good job. Now, a duck. It's a bird, I think. Okay, a duck in French is a canard. Canard. A duck in French is a canard. Canard is a duck. It says it right there. Boom. Now, a hummingbird. You know those ones that hum? A hummingbird? Yeah. A hummingbird is a colibri. A colibri. Do whatever you want with this information because, you know, not a lot of people use hummingbird in a sentence. <laughs> I love hummingbirds. J'adore les hummingbirds. J'aime les hummingbirds. Les colibri. Do whatever you want with this oh, I just grew short. Dur, dur, dur. Now I'm tall. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. Anyways. Now a cardinal. Uh there's a lot in Canada. I'm not sure where you're from, if there is, but a cardinal is those like red birds. I'll put a picture, like two pictures right there. That's a red bird. It's really pretty. I saw one countless times in my class because there's like a window behind me. Sometimes I look there and I see uh, cardinals. <gasps> They're so wow. Fascinates me. <laughs> okay. Uh, car it's the same thing in French. Uh, cardinal. 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 Yeah. That's a cardinal. Car okay now like i guess i gave you enough enough um examples of birds in french so now let me teach you whoops let me teach you um those were all the pets right now let us learn the farm the 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 animals in farms because a lot of my viewers are from Philippines, but of course other stuff like Thailand, I don't know, blah, blah, blah. But yeah, so there's a lot of farms like around the world. So the first one in a farm that all kids know is a pig for some reason, a pig. Those, those pink bulb. Yeah, a pig in French is un cochon. A cochon is a pig in French. Pig, cochon. Yeah. Okay. Now, what's another farm animal? Let's see. A cow. A cow is those animals with black and white. Sometimes brown. But like, if we draw, it's normally black and white. But of course, there it's not always black and white in real life. Anyways, um, uh, cow is in vache, or vache, va, che, vache. Cow in French is vache. So yeah. And then another one, because there are pigs and cows and sheep. sheep. Okay. Just, just thought about that. A sheep in French is... Because I have other stuff to learn. I don't have to think about sheep. Oh yeah, yeah, thank you. It's des moutons. Forgot. <laughs> des moutons. Sheeps in French is un mouton. Forgot like for a second because I have other stuff. Like I had a math exam sadly it was pretty easy though <laughs> not gonna lie anyways uh sheep in french is un mouton okay so we learned three farm animals there's more just like 
just like a horse oh i love horses i rid them like once twice every time i go to philippines probably not every time but still yeah in in baguio no sambales no baguio baguio yeah baguio i read horses in baguio right yeah baguio um that's my mom's town in philippines i read them so much times oh it was so fun I can show you a clip, like right here. Joy, what's wrong? <laughs> Ro. Still going. Still going? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, now back to me. Yeah. Anyways. A cheval in French is a horse. Ah, I mean a horse in French is a cheval. A, a cheval is in a horse in French. Horse equals cheval. Right there. Uh, I'm back. I had some technical difficulties because I... Anyways, not technical difficulties. Where was I? yeah so a horse is a cheval next uh a water buffalo like the national animal of the philippines according to my mom and it's probably right because she's from <laughs> well, thank you to my mom my mom anyways a, a water buffalo the buffalo that's like yeah a buffalo a water buffalo. Anyways, that's a carab er, carabao. Carabao. Yeah. In French, it's the same thing with different a French pronunciation. Er, carabao. 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 Yeah. Okay. So yeah, the same spelling. So I'll just spell it one word right there. That's that's a carabao. It's like a water buffalo right there. And then there is that's yeah there is also well of course in farms there there is insects they're not really animals they're insects they're like another species anyways insects in French are slash bugs in French are in fact insects in French are the insect the insect insects insect right there uh, i'm not showing pictures of insects i'll show emojis right there insects like ants the fourmi ants fourmi there's also many other yeah spiders spiders the araignée and much more so let's so those insects are insects. I mean, insects are insect. Spiders are des araignées, and ants are des fourmis. Next, let's get out of the farm names. Yeah. Well, another animal, for example, uh. Madagascar. Madagascar oh my God. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay, so like, yeah, got the idea from um, Madagascar animals. Like, you know that film, the Madagascar, right there, picture. Um, slash the savanna animals, the wild animals. So first, the king of the nature i mean the the animal kingdom i'm not it's i'm not sure let's just say it's the lion okay the lion in french is a lion same thing li oh a lion is a lion 
And now, a tiger. A tiger, in French, is, is a tigre. A lion, I mean, a tiger in French is a tigre. I have hiccups. Where was I? Okay, so, like we learned, tiger in French is tigre. And now, let's go to another animal, the wild animals, from safari, from anywhere, except your house, the, the wild animals. So, giraffe, a giraffe. In French, it's a giraffe. Giraffe. Same spelling except that there's one F. Giraffe. Oh, look, look, look. Giraffe. Giraffe. Means in French. Giraffe. Yeah. Just in case my pronunciation. Yes. Um, for example, in a sentence, uh, like, for example, a giraffe has a long neck. A giraffe has a long neck. In giraffe, a giraffe. Okay, giraffes have a long neck. Les giraffes en giraffes have une long coup. In long cou. In long cou. Le giraffes have a long neck. In, yeah. That giraffe, you know. Just like, in giraffe are in long cou. Les giraffes are in long cou. Yeah. Um, next, like, for example, in the Lion King. Um, let's see. We said a lion. What about a coyote? A coyote. A coyote in French is une coyote. 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 In coyote. So that's a coyote in French. Um, well, if you don't know what a coyote is, you probably do. But anyways, it's going to be right there. An image. Oh, wow. The dazzle. Okay, bye-bye. So we learned a lion, a tiger. For example, let's say, uh, for example, a zebra. Okay, let's go with that. A zebra, they're wild animals. A zebra, in French, it's in zebre. Zebre. A cheetah, in, I mean, a zebra in French is in zebre. Zebra. Zebra. Learn to pronounce in zebra. In zebra. It's zebra. Zebra. Okay. That's zebra in French. In zebra. Now uh, a hippopotamus. A hippo. In French, it's like almost the same thing in hippopotam a hippopotamus in french is a hippopotam you know those big gray animals right there hippopotam hippopotamus yeah okay so let me repeat hippopotamus in french is a hippopotam and the zebra in french is in zebra very good. Now let us go to a. Uh, what about another big, big gray animal? In hmm? <laughs> Oh well. Okay. Anyways, it's Erzab. Er, it means da in masculine. Yeah. So, da, say un zèbre. Un is da in masculine or the number one. But for now, it's un zèbre. Anyways, a next one uh, that everyone knows. Uh, elephant. Elef 
An elephant in French is un éléphant. Un éléphant. E -le -fant. Okay. Éléphant. You guys say it or like say in your head because you know. Éléphant. So we learned pet animals. Okay, yeah, what's pets in French? De. <laughs> okay, uh, pets in French is des an des an is des animaux domestiques. Pets in French. so des animaux domestiques is pets in French. What about farm animals? <laughs> okay, farm animals in French is des animaux de la ferme. Des animaux de la ferme, farm animals. Des animaux de la ferme. Animals from the farm, farm animals. Okay, what about wild animals? Let us see. Wild animals in French is des animaux sauvages. Is des animaux sauvages. Animal, by the way, is animals in French, and sauvage is wild. Des animaux sauvages. So we learned all that today. We learned fish. Oh yes, fish. What about fish? If we learned that in the food section, in our. <laughs> oh my God, <laughs> we. <laughs> yeah, that's dark. Oof. We. A fish. We learned it already in our last, um, last lesson. If you wanna know foods, <laughs> if you wanna know what food, in our last lesson we learned foods in French, like meat, vegetables, and fruit, and so on. So let's recap from back then. Fish in French is de poisson. But like I said in my food lesson, I, the poisson has double S because if it has one S, it means poison. Yeah. Oh, there's an echo. echo. So that's fish in French is poisson, not poison. And zzz. Poisson. S -s -s in poisson. So yeah, this is like our fifth lesson. If you want to know foods, check out lesson number four. Unless this is lesson number six, I don't know. But check our last lesson to know food and um, my other lessons. I talked about the verb a verb and the months so we learned I don't know how much you can yeah comment down below what's your favorite so thanks for watching everyone I hope you learned something new and